he creates his emotion in all the games. This is a statistical fact proved over 10 seasons. Ronaldo, he is a once-in-a-generation player. You can expect the, his goal tallies to be once in every generation. Messi, on the other hand, his goal tally was equivalent to a once-in-a-lifetime event. Myself and my colleagues at Uppsala University, what we've been trying to assess using millions and millions of ball touches is what makes Messi a genius. What we want to look at when we break down Lionel Messi is the geometry that he creates on the pitch. He's creating art on the football pitch and he's also creating these mathematical structures. What Messi does, which no other player does, not even Ronaldo, is break down the space that the opposition are trying to control. This is one of his classic goals against Bilbao. He's in this situation where there's three defenders all moving in this direction. Messi is also moving towards the goal. And the way to do that is to stop and take a step inwards. Suddenly, he's moved into a different position where each of the players that surround him are maximally distant from him. Simple mathematical calculation, the greater distance you have from your opposition, the more space and the more time you have. They're all confused. Then the end he manages to do a nutmeg and go past all three of them. They are under his spell. And on towards the goal. Messi has the can do on its feet once again. Try and stop him with two players, with three, it simply doesn't matter. Lionel Messi is a genius. There are mathematicians working in all of the clubs trying to understand the geometry of Messi and to try and think about ways of defending against him. But it's all about how quickly the players can think about these things on the pitch. You can explain, I can stand here and explain all of the theory of Messi to you, but what I can't do is go out and tackle it.